वेलकम टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल आई एम साक्षा एंड इफ दिस इज द फर्स्ट टाइम यू आर कमिंग अक्रॉस दिस पेज हेलो हाई आई डू कंसिडर फॉलोइंग मी ऑन इंस्टाग्राम इट्स वेर आर मोस्ट एक्टिव बट आई एम ट्राइंग टू बिकम मोर एक्टिव ऑन यूट्यूब एज वेल लाइफ यू सीन बाई द टाइटल ऑफ दिस वीडियो आई एम ट्राइंग आउट द फिलिप्स नेचुरली स्ट्रेट इन फाइव मिनट्स कैराशाइन प्रोटेक्शन दिस इज बेसिकली अ हीटेड हेयर ब्रश and i've been avoiding using heat on my hair because of the color i didn't want it to damage it but i've also noticed that my hair is very frizzy and especially like when it comes to like if i'm doing interviews or something like that the frizzy hair doesn't really look that nice so i thought this would help at least reduce the frizziness but give it a more natural look so i just got ordered this on amazon uh on the box it says it's 3695 i got it on amazon uh, for 2979 so i'll do the I'm, i just open to check but i haven't used it yet so the, this is what it looks like out of the pack brand new this is what it looks like it's a pretty long cord which is great uh because then you can stand in front of the mirror and do your hair you don't have to like keep balancing and try not to burn your scalp and it also has this plug which is what i would probably call the indian plug which is again very helpful so you don't have to carry an adapter especially when you're traveling it's quite light and it's purple and black two of my favorite colors yeah i represent <laughs> the other stuff that comes in the box is this little manual oh a warranty card there's nothing else i'm going to now use this heated hair brush to try to tame out the frizz in my hair and i'll let you know how it goes and whether it's worth buying I hope it is it's a lot of money. Okay, after reading the manual, I have a couple of takeaways. One, you should use it only on dry hair. I saw a lot of videos saying you should use it on like semi dry hair, but no, they say use it on dry hair. Two, don't use it with any gel, style, mousse, whatever. It should your hair should be free of product. And I think the reason why is because they don't want get product to get built up in the bristles of the brush. And uh, three is to make sure that when you're combing your hair, You don't make it flat like this because it could touch your scalp, but you rather hold your hair away and then do it. So I'm gonna do that. They also said to I'm gonna switch it on so that oh you see that light? Woo! So I put it on level one. Let me see if that's hot enough, and we'll go ahead with that. While that's heating up, let me see how long it'll take. I'll just comb my hair out. Okay now the color has become solid that took about 30 seconds to heat up which is pretty fast actually okay so i'm going to do this and i think it's quite warm but not like burning hot and so let's oh i don't know if you can see but there's a little bit of steam rising like when you straighten your hair and that looks pretty good like wow it's been so long since i've used any heating tool that this is very exciting for me done to its side you can see it's a bit frizzy this is the side that i've used the heated straightening brush i love it except i guess my only problem is because i have fine hair the hair is standing a bit flat like it isn't giving me a lot of volume like how you would expect with a blow dry but i think you could fix it with a curling brush um but i am quite impressed like my hair feels very soft silky and most importantly it's frizz free nice my hair also doesn't smell fried and i'm pretty impressed if you i'll i'll do this side also then i'll give you my final thoughts okay switch 
switching it off. I absolutely love. <laughs> okay, I absolutely love the way my hair looks. It's like very sleek. It looks shiny. And uh, hopefully I won't get any more comments. Oh, your hair looks so dry because you're coloring your hair all the time. But it looks really nice. And I'm pretty impressed with the Philips heated hair brush tool. I got some of my hair also. Uh, yeah, the pros of this definitely are that it's easy to use. It's pretty straightforward. It's quite gentle on the hair from what I can feel. And um, for the price in its in its um, field I think this was the most best rated and had the best reviews and I'm really glad I went with this choice because um, you usually don't want something that would ruin your hair right so I found this really good I think the cons the only thing probably would be your uh, that doesn't have too much of discount like it would be great if it had a discount but for a first time use man I love this and I think I would definitely keep using this so um, yeah, sorry, I was looking at myself in the viewfinder. Oh uh, yeah, if you're looking for a hair straightening brush or if you're looking for a straightener but you want less damage, definitely check this product out. And I'll put the link in the bio if you wanna try it out. And I hope you have a great week ahead. Wow, <laughs> I'm so excited for my weekend coming up ahead. And uh, if you like this video, if you found it helpful, I would love it if you could subscribe. It The support means a lot and is like a boost to like keep going and doing stuff. So. Yeah, I'll see you next time and uh, let me know if you want me to try anything else within budget, of course, but I'll try anything else. See you!